at what point is it wrong to cut funding for engineering students like myself rather than just random waste? Um, my question regards Doge, and I know that you are a big Doge guy, correct? Um, so basically my question is, should there be a systematic way to eliminate waste more than what it already is, and how should that be implemented? For example, um, I was applying to grad schools, and I am doing research in machine learning and computer architecture. The grad school could not afford to get me, so they admitted me into a master's program rather than a PhD because they do not have the funding and are scared of Doge. <clears throat> At what point is it wrong to cut funding for engineering students like myself rather than just random waste? I think it's totally right to cut your funding. If you want to be an engineer, pay for it yourself. Like, Why should taxpayers pay for your school? Because, right. because in a completely capitalist society, right, if I'm doing cybersecurity research, how am I going to sell this on a nationwide scale? Yeah, Apple and Microsoft may buy it intrinsically, but however, if this, if this research benefits the country as a whole, such as the defense sector from China, stuff like that, would it not be beneficial to keep this funding? No. Pay it for it yourself. Private sector. We fund so much stuff we shouldn't fund. We have to make tough decisions. We are borrowing a trillion dollars a year. We are a nation on financial and fiscal abyss. We're going towards a, an apocalypse. And that requires tough decisions. And so if you want to go do that program, you might have to take out a loan and bet on yourself. And, and if you think it's going to work, great. This, this changes the incentive structure. The days of us subsidizing every good story, which I'm sure it's a good story, is over. We do not have enough money to sustain the current government that we have. And so we can either make tough decisions and cut things that might make some people upset, or we can keep on borrowing trillions of dollars that we do not have and become a forever debtor nation. So I'm going to be honest. I did not expect this answer. I knew you were anti-DEI. I didn't think you would be going to be for cutting like STEM programs. No, so I'm pro-STEM. Just pay for it yourself. We can either be $35 trillion in debt, and our dollar will be worth nothing, and our nation really won't exist as a prosperous nation, or we can make tough cuts in the short term to have prosperity in the long term. And that's a bet that will, that will ensure national security. Because to your point, you're like, well, isn't this good for the national interest? My ultimate national interest is to make sure that we are a nation not in debt that is indebted to China and foreign countries. The best thing we can do is to stop our current fiscal bleed.